in a colossal display of innovation and power, Arrington Hydrogen, formerly known as Arrington Performance, stole the spotlight at the 2023 SEMA show with a groundbreaking project, the Team Throttle Monster Truck. CEO Mike Copeland, a seasoned name in horsepower innovation, showcased his third proof-of-concept hydrogen-powered engine, shattering the myth that hydrogen can't fuel high-performance engines. Now, Errington Hydrogen is at the forefront of redefining internal combustion engines through hydrogen fuel delivery systems. The belief that hydrogen can't deliver enough horsepower takes a back seat with the latest creation. The Team Throttle Monster Truck houses a 540 cubic inch big block Chevrolet engine trying to unleash a colossal 1000 horsepower plus. This bold endeavor isn't merely about power, it's a testament to Copeland's mission to prove that directly fueled hydrogen engines can be a rival to traditional combustion engines in performance. Founder Mike Copeland, with over three decades of expertise in horsepower and vehicle dynamics, has been a trailblazer in developing the technologies that breach performance and sustainability. The realization of Team Throttle's monster truck was a collaborative effort involving industry leaders. FINA, formerly known as Borg Warner, joined forces to provide the crucial injectors necessary to meet the truck's horsepower demands. The FINA M3.5 PFI H2 injectors played a pivotal role in demonstrating the performance and visibility of hydrogen injection. This collaboration not only brings hydrogen into the realm of monster trucks, but also showcases its potential in commercial and industrial applications. Paul Jensen, owner of Team Throttle Monster, expressed excitement about the collaboration, stating, Arrington Hydrogen is challenging the landscape for internal combustion, and Team Throttle Monster will be leading the sport with zero carbon emissions that bring all the noise and excitement the fans expect. And let's be honest, monster trucks wouldn't be all that exciting if they were silent. Now the grand reveal at the SEMA show was hard to miss. The imposing presence of the hydrogen-powered monster truck with a roaring 1000 horsepower signaled a paradigm shift in the perception of hydrogen's capabilities. Modified with FINA's fuel injectors and other enhancements, the 540 cubic inch big block Chevy V8 not only dispels emissions but also roars with power. The collaboration between Errington Hydrogen and Team Throttle Monster doesn't just represent a technical feat, it marks a symbolic movement in proving that hydrogen can be the fuel of the future for high performance vehicles. But as I said earlier, this isn't Mike Coburn's first rodeo. You see, Errington Hydrogen's journey hasn't been limited to monster trucks. Over the past few years, the company has undertaken various hydrogen conversions, ranging from a Ford 5 liter Coyote engine in a 1964 Ford Falcon Sprint, also powered by hydrogen, to a 6.2 liter V8 supercharged hydrogen engine powering a 1948 Chevrolet pickup truck. By the way, I made videos on both of these cars as well, so if you would like to see them, you can go and watch them after this. Now, these conversions underscore Errington's commitment to demonstrating the versatility and power potential of hydrogen across different platforms. Beyond monster trucks, the influence of hydrogen in motorsports is gaining momentum. Several racing series are exploring hydrogen combustion engines as a carbon neutral alternative to electric drivetrains, and I have made various videos on the racing teams that want to employ hydrogen. You see, the allure lies in their ability to provide a green solution without the weight of hefty batteries, while still delivering the visceral sound of a traditional gasoline engine. NASCAR's recent interest in hydrogen race cars with plans to explore Japanese developments in the technology hints at a potential shift in the racing landscape. The quest for sustainability is now converging with the thrill of racing, and hydrogen is emerging as a formidable contender. As automakers venture into electric sports cars, the quest to make them acoustically captivating has given rise to innovations like Dodge's Fratsonic chambered exhaust. This technology aims to recreate the unmistakable sound and vibrations of a V8 engine. It reflects the industry's commitment to preserving the auditory essence of high-performance vehicles, even in the age of electric power. 
But if you ask me, no fake sound can replace the true roar of an internal combustion engine powered vehicle. To end it off, Errington Hydrogen's unveiling of the Team Throttle monster truck at SEMA 2023 is more than a spectacle. It's a groundbreaking testament to power, viability and excitement that hydrogen brings to high-performance vehicles. As hydrogen continues to roar onto the motorsport stage, the echoes of its power reverberating across the automotive landscape, signaling a new era in sustainable speed and performance. Now if you guys found this video informative and interesting. I've got a lot of videos on hydrogen and how it can be used in motorsports and even in sports cars. So just get through my channel, find them and watch them. I would really appreciate it. Um, and if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers, I.